Uh, Mr. Dunbar, you wanted to see me? Uh, yes, Allison. Um, wanted to talk to you about Timmy. Oh, does the company frown upon inter-office relationships? Oh, no, no, not at all. Except for some of mine. <laughs> but that's a big he said, the rest of them said situation. <laughs> no, uh, the company frowns upon kind of relationships. Pardon me? You know, we're kind of together, but we're not together. Are you implying what I think you're implying? I'm not really implying anything. I mean, what kind of professional would I be if I were to tell you to let Tim ring the old bell once in a while? So you're telling me I should sleep with Timmy? No. <laughs> that would be against the law. Oh, my God. I can't believe you. Oh, my God. I can't believe you. Oh, so what's going on? Mr. Dunbar just told me to sleep with you. Oh, my, how terrible. <laughs> what was your answer? No! I see. I can explain. See, um, because uh, you and I are not currently being intimate, Mr. Dunbar feels I've been taking out my frustrations on him. Are you frustrated? No. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. And now that we've gotten to know each other, I was ready to resume our sexual activities. But? We'll see. Anyway, now I say we keep waiting. Oh, oh, oh wh why, why do you now say that? Well, we wouldn't want your boss thinking he had an effect on us, would we? Well, he is the boss now, isn't he? So... Still, we shouldn't give him that satisfaction. For God's sake, what about my satisfaction? <laughs> is what he'll say after hearing of our excellent plan.